Okay, so um, I'm taking time out this Sunday. I usually reserve my Sundays for uh, stuff that I want to do for myself personally. It's mostly uh, riding my bike or playing my computer games. Um, but I felt that I had to speak up about an issue that's constantly being uh, or constantly appearing on some discussion sites across the web. This is the perennial and uh, walang kamataya, never-ending debate on whether people actually uh, landed on the moon back in the 1960s. Um, so, um, yeah, it's still around. I mean, um, ever since as far as I can remember, I've always heard about stories about people not believing that we actually went to the moon. Um, part of this is because of the fact that most people actually know very little about the whole uh, Apollo program. Um, I'm going to uh, talk in Tagalog now because I don't usually use Filipino when I do these explanations, but my target audience here are, are mostly Filipinos uh, who, who have very little uh, knowledge about uh, the Apollo missions. So, uh, yung ano kasi, Kaya yung iba hindi naniniwala or ano, uh, hindi maitindihan yung itong, itong Apollo ng mga missions kasi uh, konti lang ang nalalaman ng mga tao about it. Uh, sa katunayan, kung ma-mention mo yung Apollo, ang natatandaan lang ng mga tao ay dalawang pangalan lang or minsan isang pa- pangalan lang ang associated with it. And ito yung pangalan na Neil Armstrong which is the name of the first person who walked on the moon. Hindi nyo ba alam na actually 12, there were 12 people na nakapunta na sa buwan. So, kasi actually, there were 7 uh, missions slated to land on the moon. Uh, of course, may Apollo 11, then you have Apollo 12, Apollo 13, Apollo 14, Apollo 15, 16, and 17. So, 7 yung lahat. Unfortunately, yung Apollo 13, um, nasiraan sila. So, kaya, hindi tuloy sila nakalanding sa moon. Pero umikot sila sa moon. No? And you can actually, mapapanood nyo yun sa isang movie na starring si Tom Hanks, yung Apollo 13. Hanapin nyo yun. Yun yung kasaysayan kung paano nila sinave yung mission. Muntik na silang mamatay kasi nasira nga yung ship nila. So, kahit na ba na, na ano, hindi natuloy yung Apollo 13, nagpatuloy pa rin yung Apollo program. And you, you still have Apollo 14 after that. So, bali, six missions pa rin yun. And in, in, in every mission kasi, patlo ang nakasakay sa, ano, sa Apollo spacecraft. Dalawang spacecraft kasi yan, yung orbiter na umiikot around the moon at yung lander na naglaland mismo sa moon. So, yung, ano, yung, yung orbiter, isang taong naiiwan doon. Yun yung kawawa kasi hindi siya makakaapak sa moon. Pero yung dalawa, they will be able to land on the moon and explore the moon for a while. So, nung Apollo 11, si Michael Collins yun, yung naiwan, uh, uh, orbiting around the moon. At si, of course, yung sikat, si Neil Armstrong, and si Buzz Aldrin, sila yung, nag, uh, yung umapak sa moon. But, there were actually 10 other people who, who managed to walk on the moon. Kasi, di ba, you have Apollo 12. So, si ano yun, si Pete Conrad and si Alan Bean. No? Si Dick Gordon naman yung, yung umiikot yung sa moon, Apollo 12. Now, nung Apollo 13 naman, of course, alam natin, nasiraan sila, so hindi hindi sila natuloy. And Apollo 14 naman, uh, yung umapak sa moon, si Commander si um, Al Shepard, which is also one of the uh, first uh, people to actually leave uh, Earth. Siya yung first American in space, si Alan Shepard. Pero nung Apollo 14, siya yung commander nung, nung mission na yun. And then, i- ano, yung, yung kasama niya ni Alan Shepard, si Ed Mitchell, nakamamatay lang actually ni Ed Mitchell uh, a few weeks ago. Nama, medyo may matanda na siya eh. Almost 90 years old na siya. Tapos, nung Apollo 15, eto, very exciting tong 15, 16, and 17 kasi eto yung time na nagdala na sila ng vehicle, nung uh, lunar rover. So, nung Apollo 15, commander si uh, Dave Scott and yung kanyang kasama on the moon si Jim Irwin. So, buhay pa si Dave Scott, si Jim Irwin already passed away. Then you have Apollo 16, one of my favorite missions by the way, sa Descartes Highlands. Uh, yung ano dyan, yung commander si, si John Young, my favorite astronaut, and yung kanyang kasama si 
yung pinakamasayang astronaut on the moon sa sa observe ko sa mga video si si Charlie Duke no so um masayahin siya si Charlie Duke on the moon magaganda yung footage then of course Apollo 17 uh yung dalawa the last people to actually walk on the moon si si Eugene Cerna at saka si uh ano to si um si Jack Schmidt very interesting siya lang yung talagang may training sa geology meaning geologist siya by training then training lang siya to be to be an astronaut para makapunta siya sa moon so there has only been actually one real scientist on the moon and that was Jack or Harrison Jack Schmidt on Apollo 17 so yan pa lang na information it's already too much diba na marami pa lang I mean there were actually 12 people who walked on the moon so with that wealth of information uh, you would realize na marami pang dapat yung malaman. So, yung mga assumptions na hindi nakapunta ng moon, ganyan, parang it's already too uh, ridiculous to think about it na ang dami nyo pang hindi nga nalalaman about the other missions, tapos makukonclude ka agad kayo na alam nyo na na dahil hindi nagwe-wave yung flag, or I mean nagwe-wave yung flag, or hindi nakikita yung stars na hindi talaga nakapunta yung tao sa moon. But just think about that. 12 people actually have been on the moon. So, medyo maingay na around my surroundings, so I'll just continue this video uh, later and to add more information on how they actually got to the moon. So I'll stop at this point. Man.